Hey YouTube, I'm down here in my basement in my house and I uh, thought I'd do a short little video here of, of uh, another little passion that I kind of have, um, another collection. I like to collect things that uh, I started this collection when I was a little kid. Um, I was in 4-H, grew up on a farm, I was in 4-H so I took uh, steers and stuff, uh, took some pigs, you know, market animals to the fair and I'd sell them and I was always allowed to buy something uh, at like at the end of the fair and uh, I chose to start collecting uh, scale model toys uh, farm machinery tractors um, started collecting when I was pretty young and I kind of started I, I broke off into other things um, a lot of matchbox those kind of things and then uh, scale model of trucks and equipment heavy equipment different stuff like that but uh, started out as farm equipment I'll just show you a few of the things that I've collected over the years over here we have um, this is a, a late edition here my wife's uncle worked for this company here I'm able to have these scale model trucks. I'm not exactly sure what model they are. They're Winross brand. Uh, very detailed trucks. Kind of, kind of cool. There's three of these. Start out as I believe it started out as BOC gases, and I might be wrong on that. Started out as one of these, Airco, maybe Airco, and then went to BOC. Maybe that's how it went. And then the BOC. They're uh, like a nitrogen container. Uh, gases, they hold gases company is Lindy Gas now. But these are nice. And then I do have one. This is an older one of a snap-on truck. Freight box. I got this for buying something off of one of the snap-on trucks years ago. I can't see it real well there. Find the light. Kind of cool. That's a Win Ross also, but it's licensed under the Snap-on name. Snap-on tools. All right. Shut that back off. Um, actually, let me grab my light. I'll walk over here and grab my light. I always kind of screw up when I do these something. The lighting's not real great down here. We have a uh, very tiny, see the size of these. These aren't, uh, aren't 16th. They're smaller than that. But this is like uh, next size down from a matchbox. And that's Gale equipment. That's kind of cool. And the cat stuff, caterpillar that I've collected over the years. Some of this actually came from Mark's um, a department store, grocery store, whatever it is. Believe it or not. A grater, a scraper the front shovel it's a little bit different there the buckets turned around uh, being a mine or something uh, we get the number 22 uh, this, I probably collected this stuff mostly when I was at the uh, working in the dealership thought they were cool 
There's two trucks. Uh, they've got different freight boxes on them. Both Peterbilts. They're kind of cool. The Challenger on that one. And then dump. I said these are kind of random, but they were all bought because of Caterpillar. And this, I, Dad actually got from a garage sale. It's a gift to bucket set. Yeah, got it for next to nothing. Just a novelty thing for me. I don't really do that kind of stuff as far as drinks and what have you. It's kind of cool that it said snap on. And over here, I have, I got this tractor when I was just a little kid. See, I've run the wheels off of it. It's not in terrible shape, but the decals and stuff are gone. And a few years back, I found this one on eBay. The yeah, exact identical tractor with all the decals and everything on it. Like it was hardly ever played with. I picked that up for, I don't know, I probably paid 20 bucks for it. It was just cool. As it was a relic from when I was a kid. A match holder. International Harvester. Kind of my favorite brand right at the moment. And, uh, another Peterbilt tractor. There's a model that I put together. Implement trailer. Most of the stuff's Ertl. That's basically what I started collecting. This isn't even out of the box. Most of the stuff I have is in the box here. This hasn't even been out of the box. It's a John Deere hay wagon. Uh, Precision Classics. Round baler. Forge wagon. Uh, there's a snap on dirt bike. 1995. When I got that, one of 42,000. Yeah, whatever. Still pretty cool. There's a snap on Matchbox that I got from one of the dealers. And another, oh, Hot Wheels, sorry. Another one. Get back out of here. It's a 69 Charger. I don't even remember what this one is. 70 Barracuda. So those are pretty neat. I did have a Ford truck at one time, so I bought this. Uh, it's not the same color as what I had, but uh, same body style. Uh, it's one of those snapped together models. I put it together. There's a out of the way. A blade. John Deere. Round bale carrier. Alice Chalmers. Um, D19. I know I didn't pay 50 bucks for it. I got that at an auction. There's another snap on 49 Street Rod. That's pretty cool. Green mixer. There's a planter down here. A chopper. Another Peterbilt. Livestock hauler. And some more implements down here. There's a backhoe. See that too often. Uh, there's a brush hog, a rotary hoe, and a cultivator. That stuff is just really cool to me. I love it. I fell, tripped over something there. Okay, another Pepsi big rig there. shot of it. Oh, what we got here? I think that top one was a gift. It's a 450 STX 450 with a ripper. The lighting sucks down here, so I got an external light I'm carrying around too. Um, got a Maxim. I kind of tried to keep them in brand. 
as we go down here. They're just hanging on the wall. Your shelf I put up. I need to put more shelves up. They have more stuff actually. Another Maxim. Three ninety four with dual. Oh, no, that one ain't got duals. That's deceiving. So that tires look. Green card up there. There's a trike. Boss Hoss trike. Hot Wheels. Thought that was cool. Uh, there's a fifteen eighty six. Going bigger. 60 diesel, another 560, like an orchard. Green grill, manure spreader. I have an old manure spreader. It looks like that tricycle front end tractor over there. Looks like that one. Because I had one when I was a kid and it's all beat up. I found this one and bought it. It's kind of unbelievable to me that somebody kept it for that long in the box. Which is what I'm doing right now, I guess. There's an H. I found these online. I have these. Two different sets of them. I have uh, Series 1 and the M. Uh, 39 narrow front. 39 Y front and an MV 45 MV high crop and then up here 45 MD narrow 52 MD wide 52 MDV and they're just little see them next to that these are all 16th scale on the, on the other stuff these are like matchbox size they come in a little display box and they were kind of neat. Uh, another M. Pres Prestige Collection. It's a pretty detailed tractor there. It's got all kinds of stuff on it. You can get light into it. Um, at this aircraft museum in Virginia. Seventy front wheel assist, sixteen fifty five Oliver. They have a, quite a collection for Olivers too. At one time, uh, used to be a favorite brand. Kind of moved on to international, but like the Olivers too. Another sixteen fifty five without a cab. Another collection only Olivers of the little tractors like the Farm Lambs over there. See, there's a cock shot, a mini mow, and an Oliver in each one. And an old Ford bank. And 1655 narrow front. Cock shot. So New Holland Haybine. A couple of New Holland tractor, a couple of Fords. 21 and 8730 4450 John Deere John Deere crawler can't get a good shot of that there it is 1010 and there's a 620 and it just says it's a utility tractor with a loader That's all I have out. Just kind of a collection of what I've I've accumulated over the years and in, in uh, farm toys and a couple of the Matchbox Hot Wheels collectibles. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Catch you in the next video.